this year. It's been a really long year and um, a fair bit of uh, indecision throughout out the year, but um, myself and the club have uh, come to an agreement that um, Stephen Cornelio has re-signed with the football club for another few years. Thanks for obviously the contract, Shory, number one. <laughs> no, I think um, uh, it's, yeah, it's been an emotional sort of afternoon for me. Um, you know, ultimately, I've stayed because of the group of people that are in the room tonight. Um, it's become become my family, and you know, I think you know. Although it's been a, a long a long year, and I'm, I'm sorry that to drag a lot of your boys you know through some, some questions you probably didn't want to answer, especially your mummy who's asking me every day. For the last year. Um, but I never lost that belief in um, that club and like Cambo just touched on the culture we've built and what we're building towards uh, is something that I've held on to and, and ultimately signed me uh, in the way. It's, it's the belief it's going to win us our first final next week against the Bulldogs and, and continues on to some, some special things but I don't know this year but uh, for lots of years to come. So yeah, thank you very much everyone and have a great night. <laughs> what your feelings were like when you heard the news? Oh, my feelings was relief but also just like excitement because Cogs is such a good person, um, obviously a star player and a really close mate of mine as well but the values that he brings to the footy club and the leadership that he brings and everything he brings to this club is so professional, um, he's very popular at the club, he's, he's a great person to have um, and I love the bloke so I'm absolutely wrapped. He actually came to me uh, just outside there before we all came in for dinner and um, I had a little bit of an inkling, like we had a good chat last week and you never really know but I had like a bit of over 50% chance that I thought he would stay and then he did tell me outside and I sort of just jumped at him, big hug, you know, smile from ear to ear. It's, um, it's his footy club and like to, to have him re-sign and recommit to us, um, I know he, uh, it was a long process for him but like just for, for him to, um, you know, have his imprint on this footy club and right from the start just means so much. Monumental night really. Um, we've had a few obviously along the way but um, this one's probably more heightened than ever just because of what he means to the club as a whole but also the playing group. He's been here since day dot, been through some tough times. His individual story is pretty amazing too in terms of you know, for a high draft he went through a fair bit of adversity there but he's just a great person and you know, he's the future captain of this club and um, the offers uh, from other clubs where, where they should have been if not a bit under in my opinion um, and uh, to keep him on you know on what this club's about is just a huge day ecstatic unbelievable day for the club and uh, I think it's uh, put us all in a really um, amazing position when you have somebody like Cogs and especially you know everything that's been reported through the year and the constant dialogue around his situation and then in the end to stay with the club is just absolutely massive and you know, speaks volume of him, his character, you know, his family, what kind of person he is and and what kind of club we're growing here and the culture we are, it, it does, it speaks volumes of that and um, yeah, I don't know, just over the moon. Yeah, yeah, I was late getting here because um, I had to pick the missus up in the city and then got stuck in traffic so I did tell one of the coaches but obviously he had no idea either. Um, but yeah, it's enormous for the club, you know, to hear that Cogs has re-signed for another seven years it's, it's a very long contract but um yeah awesome for the club and i heard the place erupted so i'm looking forward to seeing the footage um of it as i did miss it and what does it um do for this club that he's resigned yeah i think it's awesome uh he's been positive all year even though um you know he, he didn't put pen to paper throughout the season but uh you know he was injured and what he's done behind the scenes uh, with the younger boys especially and, and with his rehab has been awesome and obviously he's a great leader for the club so I can't wait to see uh, where he takes us.